okay so far we are recording this billing address and redirecting back to the card page only right but we should actually redirect the user to the payment page okay so in this one we are actually uh, going to implement the paypal payment gateway okay so in the payment page we'll be having a paypal buttons and uh, you know paypal pay buttons and as well as in the left side of the uh, page we are going to have the uh, you know just uh, a review of what he is uh, you know what he is going to buy okay so maybe the billing address and uh, the pay, pay payment method as well as we can also show him the uh, list of orders he is going to buy and on the right side we'll be having a paypal button okay so when you click on the pay button so it will automatically fetch the uh, total amount of this order and it will uh, go to the paypal server and if the you know payment is success then we'll be getting the response from the paypal so according to the paypal response we are going to show uh, the success page or the failure page okay so that's how it is going to work so now we are going to make a pay payments uh, url okay so for the payments page of course we need paypal you know payment uh, uh, url right so let's go ahead and make this payment uh, urls so in the orders uh, urls.py so here i'll make one path let's call it a payment payments and comma views dot payments name is equal to payments okay okay not like this okay so this should not be inside a quotation and i'll make a um here on top of this uh, place order i'll make a define payments i'll take a request here now let me say return um return render a request comma store uh, not store this should be orders slash payments dot html all right so now uh, let's uh, let's make one template uh, check out is inside uh, the uh, store right so what i'll do i'll just uh, create a new folder and call it uh, orders and i'll make uh, payments.html inside this order folder okay the next thing is uh, let me let me just copy this okay copy this cart.html code and put it inside the pay payments.html okay for now i will say i don't need this if condition okay in the bottom of the a page also we have this end if we don't need this okay and okay you uh, save this file also and now if you go to this uh, order slash payments oh wait uh, something is wrong Okay, I should uh, put this forward slash. Okay, still this is uh, the error. Okay, now uh, not uh, order, this is orders. Okay, now it is fine. Okay, now we have the payment page. Uh, we'll just modify it to uh, according to what we need. Okay, first of all, uh, in the aside aside tag class call lg so let's make it 8 okay and come down and here let's make it 4 okay, so that what will happen so this box will be a little bit bigger and it will be a little bit smaller okay so this is enough i guess next thing is uh, actually we will get rid of this shopping 
uh, continue shopping button as well as we will uh, uh, remove this uh, table also here i'll uh, i'll remove this continue shopping button if you want to keep you can keep so in place of uh, checkout i'll say make payment and uh, we don't need this table okay so i will just remove this table for now all right I'll refresh okay we don't have anything here so now what i want to do here is i want to just put the bootstrap cards here okay so if you go to uh bootstrap card okay bootstrap card example then you will see this bootstrap cards okay so these are all the bootstrap cards yeah i want something like this okay here uh, what i need is uh, this one uh, maybe not this one maybe this one we, we need okay so i will copy this and put it here okay okay i will remove this and paste it here so this featured will remove and uh, let's say billing address now refresh so this is billing address and we don't need all these things okay we need this text but uh, you know we i think this is the uh, p tag and we know we don't need button and we don't need uh, this h, h you know header also we'll remove this and we will remove this button all right so we have this billing address now the same way we will uh, uh, copy this and paste it here two times so here i will say payment method and this is uh, this is a review products okay so we have billing address payment method and review product so here we will like actually have to uh, print the billing address just to show him the preview of his billing address okay so payment method by default we are actually going to use uh, paypal and this review uh, products here we will uh, print the products okay so this total price tax and grand total so he, in between here we will be having uh, the paypal buttons okay for now i will stop this video and in the next one we will continue this okay thank you